picture this. It's 2 a.m. and you're exiting the club and you're hungry. Oh wait, no, you are hangry. You can't go back to your hotel or Airbnb because the only snack you'll find is yourself. So what do you do when you're hungry? Don't worry, boo, I got you. Welcome to Drunk and Delicious, the ultimate food series on late night eats around the world. You may or may not be tipsy, but everything you eat is gonna be tasty. Meow. In this episode, we are in Taipei, Taiwan, known for its late night street eats, to try sexy, slurpy sesame this noodles. This is just absolute insanity. The first Taiwanese restaurant is open 24 hours a day. 24 hours. The star of the shop, black sesame noodles. Oh my goodness, you guys. Right in front of me, what I have is black sesame noodles. Here's the thing, most of the stuff that I cover on the channel, I've already tried it, but this time, I'm trying this with you guys for the first time. I love the way this creamy sesame sauce right here, you can see it's, it's pretty, it's quite thick. It's just covering the noodles nicely. And then if you look closely, you can see the graininess of the sesame just covering these noodles. Oh, I can't, can't wait to slurp. Are you guys ready? Here we go. Oh, the sesame, even though it's so thick and creamy looking, it just adds a nice savory flavor to noodles. Sometimes sesame can become too grainy, but this is just nice and smooth. I, I think it's just a perfect, look at that, perfect coating. Let's get one more slurping. Personally, I think this small bowl is just like the perfect snack. You can see there's a couple of veggies here, it's not too much. Really the star is just the sauce and the noodles and then that's it. That's it, that's it, that's all you need. That's all you need. Drunk cheese, hey! Oh, this is a great time to remind you to check out the Cup of TJ merch shop. Be sure to get your Send Nudes tank, t-shirt, and hoodie. When Bay asks you to send nudes, get dressed in this. <laughs> love a good commercial break. You know, love, love a good commercial break. In this restaurant, you don't just get the black sesame noodles, you also have to try their sesame dumplings. Now this right here is another item that I've never tried before, so I'm so excited. What's inside? Why is it black? We're gonna find out. Oh my goodness. So it looks like they mix the sesame paste with pork and it creates this nice, flavorful, juicy meat inside. I will have to say that color is interesting. All right, if you tell me we're gonna eat some black dumplings, like I don't know how I feel about that, but it tastes pretty darn good. I kinda wanna like pop it all in my mouth. Mm. Oh my God. To properly enjoy these, pop the whole thing in your mouth because you're gonna bite into it and that juice is just gonna score out and it's amazing. Now here's the thing, you need to add some flavors to it, all right? So we're gonna, we're gonna dump some of this chili oil on top. Just a lightly drizzle, just a chili bay. <laughs> now that your dumpling is properly covered in chili, it's gonna be way more enjoyable. Oh, oh my God. This chili is so spicy. <laughs> Usually when you add chili sauce around restaurants here, it's like more of a sweetness to it, but that chili paste or chili oil, huge kick. Oh, now I'm feeling the ting tingleness on my tongue. That is crazy spicy, but that's crazy good. I'm starting to sweat. That's the kind of spiciness I like. Oh, oh yeah, <laughs> this is so good. After you're done with the noodles, after you're done with the dumplings, if you still want something more, this soup right here is like a beautiful wonton soup and there's egg, there's fish ball, and there's wonton. We're gonna try some of these wontons. If they taste anything like that dumpling, I'm gonna be so happy. Ready? Oh yeah. A nice soft dough, it kind of just melts in your mouth. I'm gonna take a bite into this fish ball. I love that soup drip. <laughs> I didn't eat this. <laughs> Oh my goodness, you guys. There's filling inside this fish ball. I think it's pork filling. And look at that, all that juice coming out, all that flavor. Oh my goodness. That is such a pleasant surprise. I'm gonna get some soup and just eat this whole thing. Mm. 
the soup is pretty darn good. Do I have sesame on my face? <laughs> second stop to get some more sesame noodles. Now this particular shop, what's special about it is that it's opened only at 9.30 p.m. So literally this restaurant has dedicated itself to all the night owls and party animals and late nighters in the world. <laughs> clap for them, clap for them. Currently it's about 9.20 so we've been waiting around like 10 minutes. We came a little bit early and right now they're just prepping it and it's crazy because I'm standing here and I can feel the heat just coming from the kitchen and I can smell it. I can smell that peanut sauce, that sesame sauce. I'm like, it's gonna be good. Let's wait in line. There's already a line, isn't that crazy? <laughs> I love a good mixing food porn. Hell yeah! Right in front of me. Oh, I am so excited. One of my favorite things in the world is sesame cold noodles. And check out this huge mountain of noodles. This is just absolute insanity. Could I lay in this pile of noodles? I don't know what's with me and wanting to lay in my food. I want to lay on stacks and stacks of these eggs and just sleep on it, just like. Like that. I don't know. <laughs> I just don't want to sleep with it. It's crazy because I was standing there and I saw the chef just like stirring this huge bundle of noodles and he's just lifting it in the air. It was like flying. <laughs> it was crazy. <laughs> That's why I'm so excited to take a bite into this. This sesame coating, thick, baby girl, T H I C C. That sauce is just coating that noodle beautifully. It's literally just, just hugging onto the noodles like, never let me go. Never let me go. Oh my gosh, it's a huge fire. Mm. Mm -hmm. That sesame paste is so thick and creamy. So sesame paste, the ingredients inside it, there's sesame oil, there's peanut butter paste, sesame paste, there's ginger, there's a, a mix of everything. And in this one specifically, I can really taste that peanut butter and I love it, I really do. There's a creaminess to the sauce that I really do enjoy. And here's the thing, what I love about cold noodles is they add these cucumber slices. So as you're eating this soft chewy noodle, you get this light crunch from the cucumber. I mean, it's just, it's just a wonderful texture. Like, Here's another thing I love about the shop. We're literally right next to a busy street. Can you take, take a look at that? Do you hear all the motorcycles going by? At 3, 4 a.m., 5 a.m., 6 a.m., I know you guys, you're stumbling out from the club and you're hungry. Welcome, welcome to noodle heaven, okay? <laughs> One more slurp, that, it definitely deserves that. Mm. Mm -hmm. That is so creamy. I will say, that the sesame paste, it's almost too thick, so thick that it kind of like clogs your throat a little bit. So you definitely gotta hydrate yourself with some of this soup. Oh, snaps right here, ladies and gentlemen, check this out. So this, I believe, is a miso egg soup with some of these, this meatball right here. And oh, look at some, there's some tofu in there and, and the way the egg is just blended. Look at the way the egg is just dangling from my spoon. Eat me. I will. Oh. Oh my god. Oh my god. This, there's something about this miso soup that I love so much. I think it's the fact that they put the egg in there and the, the egg is kind of scrambled. So it's like, it's like flowy egg and then there's some tofu pieces in there and then there's like that nice miso flavor. I mean, Oh gosh, I think the soup is one of my favorite dishes from today. Take a bite of this meatball. Oh, thick, chewy, it's got a nice bounce to it. It's a good meatball. But man, I seriously love this soup. 
Oh. What I like to do is if my noodles a little bit too thick or dry, I just get some of the soup. I just kind of drizzle it over the noodles. And that's just going to soften the noodle a little bit and add a little more moisture. Because some people, they don't like the clumpy and stickiness. So what this is going to do is just soften it up a little bit. And yeah, see? Now it's got a nice glisten. Oh my gosh. Wow, that's beautiful. That's beautiful. Sesame Newt, do you love me? Are you riding? Come see me, Drake. Oh, oh I almost forgot. So you can actually get egg in a couple different ways. You can get it over easy. You can get it with onions, which I personally love. But the onion adds a nice savory taste um, to the egg, and it's a nice aroma. Good, paired egg with the sesame noodles, some of this miso soup. And this is the ultimate drum cheese. It's the ultimate, ultimate drum cheese. Personally, I prefer this light, tannish kind of sesame sauce over the black sesame noodle that we just had. Um, there's just something about this overall flavor that I, I really enjoy. This plate right here, for all of these noodles, it's only 50 NT. What is that? Two dollars? That's I'm shook. That's crazy. You literally will spend three, four dollars and your tummy will be filled. You're gonna wake up feeling blessed. Feeling blessed. Well, I'm gonna drink more of this soup, finish all of these noodles, and I'll catch you guys at the end of this video, okay? So that was a two different sesame noodle restaurant that you can eat throughout the night. So one restaurant is 24 hours and one specifically opens at 9.30 and then closes in the morning. So anytime you come out of the club or you know you're studying late or you know you're gaming late or whatever you uh, kids do nowadays, uh, you can come get your noodles, okay? So now I'm gonna bring it back to you guys and for you guys to decide which of the two noodles, the black sesame noodles or this sesame noodles, which of them would you try? Thank you so much for watching today's Drunk and Delicious and I'll see you guys in the next episode. Bye! Oh, safe drinking kids. Make sure it's legal. And um, drink lots of water, stay hydrated. Bye! Sesame nudes, do you love me? <laughs> Sesame nudes, do you love me? Are you riding? So you'll never ever leave from beside me because I want you. <laughs> Come see me, Drake. <laughs> Take five, <laughs> one more time.